Okay. Now, is that not a disgusting sight? I was out for about one, about two and a half hours, and I come back. Let me get situated here. I come back, and the tick is just engulfed in eggs. It is disgusting. <laughs> and her little female friend here. Same thing. She's farther along than the other one. I say we have close to about three to four thousand eggs right now, so we are gonna go past they're I mean they're 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 all over the bag. I mean in little clumps all over. If they fall if I pick up the bag up and they fall, they drop the eggs. So there's just there's masses amounts of clumps of eggs all over. So I mean, this is pretty interesting to see myself, even though a friend of mine is worried that I'm going to have ticks running all over, because I'm not. As soon as I see them hatch, they're going into uh, a big, nice backyard uh, fire. So, but I just wanted to show the update while she was engulfed, like literally headless and this and like from the looks of the anatomy it looks it's not coming from their mouths there's like a little area I guess it would be her the JJ and it's by the mouth and she pulls them out from there and it looks like they're coming from the head which again is pretty gross you know you'll see them move their legs and one thing is for sure, they are very protective of their eggs. Like, they just stopped moving because um, the light turned on. They only do this in the dark. And I watched them in the dark. I can't quite film it. And um, I can see them pushing the eggs out, which is really gross. But uh, just my little update on my my female tick experiment so I think we're gonna have babies fairly soon even though I have been crushing a large port by the way these things are no bigger than a pinhead but very tough I can't even squish them like you have to get your nail and dig into them and you feel and hear a pop and it's significantly loud for as small as these things are but still pretty gross so We'll meet when we see the babies, or if this gets any neater.